Well, howdy folks, and welcome back to the garage. What do you think of the reworking of the premium garage? I like it. It looks even nicer than the old one. It looks cleaner. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Now, is there anything else you notice that looks a bit different? Maybe anything? Could it be camouflage? <laughs> yes, it is. Tank camo has finally come to Blitz, and it looks fantastic. Having camouflage on your favorite tank makes that tank feel that much better. It, like it just gained a superpower or something. In-game, you will now have access to 41 different camouflage patterns, some of which are seasonal and nation-specific. Some are season-specific, but available to all nations. And there are two patterns that are universal. Sound confusing? Yeah, I know. Let's have a look a little more closely here. So, here we have our Tier 10 American Medium, the M48 pattern. When we hit the camouflage button here, we are taken to the camouflage selection area. The top three camouflages indicated here are specific to the summer season and to American vehicles. In the next row, these two patterns are summer specific but available to all nations. The last two patterns, the universal patterns, can be worn by any tank of any nation in any season. If you click on the winter or desert buttons, you can see that the same setup applies. Also notice that you can have a good look at your tank all dressed up before you buy the camo by hitting this button in the top right hand side of your screen. That looks pretty good. Now you can watch the slideshow I put together of the different camo patterns while I explain just a couple more things. Camouflage is treated as a consumable in Blitz where you will pay credits for each pattern you choose for each season. Pricing starts at 500 credits per pattern at Tier 1 and climbs to 3,000 credits per pattern at Tier 10. That sounds steep, especially at Tier 1 where you will have to fork out 1,500 credits to fully equip your tank with camo to get a different pattern for each season. At Tier 10, that will be 9,000 credits. So what is the point of the camo? Just to make your tank look cool and empty your credit balance? Not at all. Camel gives your tank an advantage, making it harder to detect your vehicle while camo is worn. By far, TDs receive the most benefit of this with a 4% reduction in your detectability. Lights and mediums receive a 3% reduction and heavies bring up the rear with a 2% reduction. Every little bit helps though, right? So that's Camo and Blitz as of update 2.5. Due to be released in the near future, it will be very interesting to see how the players react to it, I think. I can already hear the pay-to-win zealots pulling up their signs and banners proclaiming the end of the game as we know it, but time in the real world servers will tell whether this is worth running or will it need some adjustment in the future. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Well folks, that's all the time I have right now, but I'm really glad I was able to bring you this info. Update 2.5 promises to be another great addition to the game. If you like this video, please consider hitting the thumbs up underneath, and if you really like our videos, why not subscribe? You'll get a notice every time we share more awesome content, and that way you don't miss out. As always, be sure to visit our Facebook and Twitter pages to get all the info that doesn't find its way into our videos. Okay folks, thanks very much for stopping by and watching. I'll catch you next time.